Hey, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about the latest beta update from Google. So if you're running the Android 15 beta program, you'll definitely want to check this out. So about a month ago, we had what's called the last scheduled update before the official release of Android 15. And just this month, they've gone ahead and pushed out another update, which is the beta 4.2. With beta 4.2, uh, there are some new fixes. Um, so we're going to go ahead and talk about those. We'll talk about the phones that are going to be supported. So let's go ahead and jump into it and see what the new update brings us. Okay, for those of you that aren't familiar uh, with updating your Pixel device, you're simply going to swipe down from the top, swipe down again, hit that settings icon, then we're going to scroll down until we get to system, we're going to select system, and then we're going to scroll down to software updates. We'll then click on software updates, and then click on system update, and if there's any updates available, then it will have them here in the update screen. Sometimes you'll need to click this button here to check for an update. It'll go out and check the update servers. I've just installed this, so it's not going to show it. Um, but this is how you're going to update. It'll also show you the version of Android you're running and the security update. So this is August 5th. So uh, just got the new update on here, which is really cool. Wasn't expecting another update on the beta, uh, waiting for the official release of Android 15. Uh, Google just announced the Pixel 9 phones, uh, which are shipping with Android 14, which is kind of a bummer. I thought they would ship with 15. But anyway, um, this new update is really cool because this is going to bring us some fixes um, that were left out in the 4.1 update. So in this update, it's going to bring, um, it fixed an issue where some devices were delayed in waking up. So if you went to wake up your device, there was a slight delay there. Uh, another thing that was fixed is the gray transparent bar was appearing when using the camera. Um, so these are all different fixes that were announced in this update. I have not experienced most of these. Uh, it fixed a camera issue that was causing low frame rates. Um, so if you had that issue, that should be resolved with the 4.2 update. Uh, fixed a camera issue that was causing it to crash when changing zoom values. So if you were going from different zoom, that would end up crashing the phone. Uh, it also fixed an issue with the camera saturation. So there's a lot of camera fixes in this update, which is really nice to see. Um, let's go ahead and uh, jump into that update. Um, we're going to go ahead and go to about phone. I'm going to go ahead and scroll down here. Uh, so the build number is AP31.2406160. Uh, so that's going to be the build number that you're going to look for. Um, the update is about 59 megabytes. So it's not too big. Um, so it, it's just a incremental update, but it's nice to see that Google's still pushing out updates on Android 15. They want to make sure that that is ready for the official release. Uh, so this is going to be available on the Pixel 8 series phones, Pixel tablet, Pixel Fold, Pixel 7 series phones, and the Pixel 6 series phones. Unfortunately, uh, I do not see this being available for the um, Pixel 5 series or below. Uh, a couple other fixes that were on here was it fixed an issue that was causing the UI to flicker. Um, so I actually did experience this, and I'm, I'm curious to see if that's gone. Every once in a while, the UI would get a flicker. Um, that's supposed to be resolved. And then it also fixed an issue that was causing YouTube to crash. Um, I have not experienced that, but if you were watching YouTube on your Pixel and it was crashing, uh, this should resolve that issue. So the last patch that we got was in July for the 4.1, uh, which fixed a phone calling issue. Um, so we'll go ahead and check that out. Uh, if you want to join the beta, it's really simple. All you have to do is go ahead and open up your browser. 
we're going to go ahead and go to Android 15 beta. And when you do that, you're going to have the um, beta program here. You can just simply click on that. It will show you what your eligible devices are. So if we click on view eligible devices, we'll scroll down. You can see here's my Pixel 8 Pro that we're on. Uh, if I had any other Pixel devices, that would show up there. And you will have the option to opt in. Uh, if you're not in the beta, you'll go ahead and click opt in. Once you do that, once you opt in, then you're just going to go back into your settings and you're going to do that software update again. And when you go to do the software update, it's going to download the new beta software. Uh, please keep in mind, anytime you're running beta software, there are going to be bugs. Um, so I wouldn't advise running it on your daily driver if you have another phone um, that you use on a regular basis. And this is a secondary phone, then it's great to check this out. If you have any questions, please make sure to leave a comment below. I'll be happy to get back to you. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to give us a thumbs up. Click the subscribe button so that you don't miss any future videos. And also make sure to click the bell notification so you're updated when new videos get uploaded. As always, appreciate you watching, and we'll catch you in the next video.